Titan was a phase three registration trial of patients who had castration sensitive metastatic prostate cancer. And as we know, apalutamide is a direct specific androgen receptor inhibitor. In this trial, more than 1,000 patients were randomized to standard of care therapy, which included chemotherapy. So if patients wanted to get chemotherapy, they were allowed to get chemotherapy. None of, basically all patients who had any form of castration sensitive metastatic prostate cancer, whether they had low volume or high volume disease, whether they had visceral metastasis or not, it did not really matter what was their Gleason score. Anyone with castration sensitive metastatic prostate cancer were allowed, were eligible for this trial. And they were randomized to standard of care therapy with androgen suppression therapy versus androgen suppression therapy with apalutamide. As I said, prior receipt of chemotherapy at the onset of metastatic castration sensitive prostate cancer was allowed. And what we saw was really, again, dramatic. There was a 33% reduction in risk of death. So the trial had dual endpoints, two endpoints, which it, we call it dual uh, primary endpoints. And they were overall survival and radiographic progression-free survival. So this trial is unique from other trials in the sense that it, has, it had this dual primary endpoints of overall survival and radiographic progression-free survival. And both were met at the time of first interim analysis at, after a follow-up of only 22 months. So this is another example of how good the drug is. So there was a 33% redu risk reduction as far as overall survival is concerned. There was patients who received apalutamide, there, were, there was a 33% reduction in risk of death. Regarding radiographic progression-free survival, there was a 52% reduction in risk of progression or death. With these primary endpoints being met at the time of first interim analysis, this basically tells us the drug is very effective, and we are really hoping that it will lead to FD approval and availability of this drug for our patients in a very near future, and we are talking about few months. I'd like to point out one more thing about Titan study. The side effect, we always talk about side effects, how our patients feel when they, they get these newer drugs. The side effect profile, if you look at grade three, four side effects, which are clinically meaningful side effects, really there was no difference in the grade three, four side effects. There were 40% in the control arm and 42% in the experimental arm or in the apalutamide arm. So we are really not impacting quality of life. We are actually preserving quality of life while we are increasing survival in a very meaningful fashion.